My unpopular opinion is that uh, WebAssembly runtimes will replace container-based runtimes by 2030. The advantages of WebAssembly with its uh, tight security model, its very fast boot up time, uh, scalability at the edge with much smaller footprints, its portability across environments will really drive a shift away from container-based runtimes um, for things like Kubernetes and edge edge workloads um, by by 2030. And there's a ton of ton of energy around uh, making this happen within the the WebAssembly community. What do you think is the largest barrier to getting there now? question yeah i would say likely language like like language support um profiling and tooling i think like i think as we've talked about today a lot like like getting to a point where you can optimize and 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 profile the web assembly a lot a lot easier i think is a big thing and the standardization so there's a lot of really exciting changes to web assembly that are coming along i think we've talked about a couple of them already around multi-threading support and garbage native garbage collection support um one of the, the 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 big changes that are coming to WebAssembly is called the component model, um, which is a way to standardize the communication uh, across multiple um, WebAssembly components, and they can talk to each other and really sort of like make your code a lot more componentized and in in, in in smaller chunks. And so that's a big effort that the community is working on to drive um, drive towards sort of replacing containers, larger containers in these sort of Kubernetes and, and edge edge uh, workloads. So um, yeah, so I think those are the big things that if the WebAssembly community can get sort of those 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 big changes that are coming, the component model, multi-threading, um, garbage collection support, and, and many other things um, down, then um, I think we'll be on that path and we'll see some big companies um, start up around, around the space in, in the coming years. Yeah.